Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are diving into something super excited, the latest and the greatest in the world of email management. That's right, we are talking about 10 essential new Microsoft Outlook tips and tricks of 2024. Whether you are a seasonal Outlook user or just getting started, these tips are going to revolutionize the way you handle your emails. So grab a cup of coffee, settle in and let's explore these amazing tips and tricks together. And hey, if you have find this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. For more awesome content, let's jump right in and make Outlook experience better than ever. Let's start with the first one, which is pinning email. When you focus on your inbox and when you hover your mouse on the specific email, you will check out a small option, which is pin. Keep this message on the top of your folder. So when I click on this pin, a message will automatically jump on the top of the list. And whenever I receive a new email, that email will be on the top every time. So this is the option to pin your message. And there is another option when you click on the home tab, there is an option in the tag section, which is pin and unpin. When you again click on this pin, the message will again jump on the top of your folder. You can again click on this option pin to unpin that. So that message will return back where it belongs. Next is my day, which is available on the top right corner of your screen. When you check out these options, the first option is my day. When you click on it, a small navigation section appears here. The beauty of this my day is when you want to add a specific email to your calendar or your to do list, you can simply select the email, drag it, and you will see there are two options, add as a task and add as an event. When I drop my message here, you will see the event is added in my calendar and I will get a small window over here where I have to add some additional information like I want to add the timing, the date. And if I want to repeat it, I can use this option here. I can add or modify some additional information from the ribbon options here and simply send it, which will automatically add it in my calendar. So currently I will close this, discard it. And the second thing I want to show you, and when I again drag my email and add here, add as a task, that will also add it in my task section. And when you check out this option, that will open my to-do section in a separate window, like this. And if I go to the calendar and click on this open cal calendar, I can again click on it and that will open in a separate window once again. Next tip, really save me from the annoying situation. I have created an email and I want to send this email to my publisher to publish in his book. But the problem is when I send this email, that email instantly send that email to my sender and accidentally I forget to add my social media links to my article. So to fix it, I want to again review this and want to change few backend settings in my system. So I simply click on this gear icon from the top right corner of my screen. And that, that will take me to the setting dialog box. Here I have to select mail from the left navigation section. Click compose and reply. In the right area, I have multiple options. Scroll down a little bit and you will see an option undo send. You can cancel an email message after you have selected send. To cancel selected an undo button that appears at the bottom of your screen. So the message can be canceled for up to 10 seconds. You can choose how long Outlook will wait to send your message. Currently it is zero second. So you can select or set up the time up to 10 seconds according to your requirement. Simply hit save, 
close this dialog box now again i will show you click on the new email again want to create my email message i want to enter the email address of my publisher now when i click on the send button you will see the undo is appear here i can simply hit this undo button to reverse the message and save my article from sending with the missing elements have you checked out this feature when you check your send button there is a drop down beside it when you click on the drop down there are two options first is send that means that email will be directly sent from outlook and next is schedule send when you click on schedule send it will give you few options you can also send the email tomorrow morning sunday morning or you can customize your time and date of sending your email and i click on that you can select the date you can select the time and simply hit send that will schedule your email to send later on according to your time and date you have selected next is quick action when you hover your mouse in your inbox to an specific email you will check out two options flag this message and pin this message if you want to add additional options here you can simply go to the setting button click on mail and here is an option customize action when you click on it simply scroll a little bit there is an option quick actions so there are three options already selected delete pin and flag you can also add archive mark as read or unread or you can also add move to the folder so when i click on that i will get a notification too many actions selected a maximum of four quick actions are supported at that time so you have to uncheck few options if you want to add say if i want to add this option move to a folder i need to uncheck the selected one so i remove delete from it and simply hit save close this dialog box and see when i again hover my mouse on the email i will see few options which are move to there is this option mail you can flag it you can pin it next essential tip is sweep feature when you select an email and go to the ribbon on the home tab you will see an option which is sweep under move section when you click on that sweep you will check out for messages from although i have selected a single message so the sweep will work on this email address only so there are four options move all messages from the inbox folder move all messages from the inbox folder and any future messages third option is always keep the latest messages and move the rest from the inbox folder last one is always move messages older than 10 days from the inbox folder and you can select the folder from this drop down there are few folders already available and you can create a new folder from here the purpose of the sweep message is to lighter down your inbox you will receive daily email on your inbox and your inbox is filled with number of emails so this sweep message feature can move your desired email messages to your specific folder next is keyboard shortcut there are numerous keyboard shortcut available in outlook classic but if i am talking about new outlook you will check out the list of keyboard shortcuts using shift forward slash when you click on it you will see a small attachment appears consist of multiple keyboard shortcuts you can see if you want to write emails you will have few options here email list read email email actions and go to these are quick keyboard shortcut you can use to execute your action in microsoft new outlook next is search bar you can use control e keyboard shortcut to jump directly to the search bar so here when i tap something like i want to type this credit word so you will check out few emails having the word credit or you can also check out few pdf files which consist of the word or keyword credit when you click on this reverse pyramid symbol that will open 
a detailed form where you can very easily narrow down your search by entering a specific email address, subject, my keyword is already there. You can also enter the date you receive that email or you can also select this checkbox if you want the emails which having attachments and simply hit search button. That will go give you exact list of emails you are searching for. Thank you for tuning in to today's video where I shared my personal top tips and tricks for new outlook. If you found these insights helpful, please show your support by hitting the like button and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to click the bell icon too so you never miss out on future videos packed with more outlook tips and solutions. Your engagement help me create content that caters to your needs and interests. Stay tuned for more and as always keep optimizing your outlook experience. Thank you and have a nice day.